Oh, this must be the hut. Can they sense me through walls? I hope not, because I'm uh, about to un unstealth. Got the key. Got the key. Let's stealth. Can you imagine how painful this would have been if I don't have stealth? Or if you guys had pointed out that I have stealth? Oh man, we would have been here all day. Do not stop. I promise you a thousand deaths if you can think about putting down that pick. Wow. These aren't very nice people. What do you need, stranger? Did you obtain the key, Zindar? I thank you, Zindar. My people will soon be here free thanks to you. I mean, you've got the key, but are you the one who's going to go out and free them? The Dreadcoated Elders. Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought it would be me. The Dreadcoated Spirit is broken because our Elders are imprisoned. Take this key and go downstairs to free them. They are Morad the Wind Stirrer, Akoro the Firecaller, and Eilan the Wind Water Waker. Well, we know where Eilan is. Once they are free, the spirits will return to the Dreadwood tribe. Go on, then. Okay, what are you? Like the precursor to, uh, Bonsamdi? With that accent? Oh, I was reading Catbomb, I'm an idiot. Alright. Well, we know where one is. And I think there was another one next, yeah, another one next to them. Because there was two exclamation points, which means I could have gotten this quest from any of the elders. Azrath! Ah, that's breath is fine. It's miles away. Hello, Morod, the wind strider. Light. Must Walk remember free, the light. Elder. Bring the spirits back to your tribe. Peace for you. You freed me. The winds speak to my people once again and grant us a strength. I thank you, stranger. You're welcome. I tell this dude he's free. And he just continues to sit there. Oh, well, that sounds like a new problem, sir. I am moving on. Aelhan, you too are free. Be survived. I'm free. The spirit of water returns to my people. It will bring us the wisdom we need to survive this harsh land. I'm in your debt, Zindar. And let me guess, he's just going to plop back down as well? No, he stays standing. Nope, he takes a knee once more. I'm so glad you guys are free to be out of this place. So you're free, but still within your confines? How is that freedom? Still confined by invisible shackles. Akaru the fire caller. You come back sometime. I am free. I will ask the spirit of fire to return to us so that my people may have the courage to fight their masters. Thank you, Torin. You're welcome. I'm gonna assume I have to go back to Naradu. Naradu? I don't remember this person's name. I'm impatient. What can I say? Naladu, Kosnov. Hello, stranger. Tell me, Zindar, have the Dragonlord Elders been released? Yeah, and they sit there and did nothing. I can feel it, Zindar. The spirits are returning to us. More? Az... Wahaha? Az, that's the most... Please, sir, you must be joking. Yes, the elemental spirits have returned to us. We are not as strong as we once were, but a little magic can go a long way in the right hands. Azath has great powers bestowed upon him by his Dark Lord. Take this staff. It was once a great symbol of our tribe. Use it against Azath and his powers will be temporarily removed from him. That doesn't make him any less sturdy. Defeat him then, so that my people may finally be free. Use the staff of Dread Dreghood Elders on Azath the Merciless and slay him after he's lost his powers. Return to Naldu at the ruins of Shannar after completing this task. This is gonna suck. Turn on. Oh god. Is it just the thingy? Yeah, okay. Well, let's just hope we can take him on uh, not near other people, other creatures. It says here, but he's like totally not here. Where are you? Please be located near nobody else. Okay. Gonna go back this way a little bit. Then we're going to click on you. Use the staff! 
bit of wall stomp, a bit of that, and take the roots. Back the fuck up. Oh, he's actually really easy to kill. <laughs> Once you get rid of his powers, he's like a bloody kitten. 2 HP. Wow. Okay. And I stressed about that because. It almost seems like that was a little too OP. <laughs> that seemed really, really, really easy. That broken worm gave you that staff, didn't he? Did he also tell you he's the one that sold out his tribe? No matter. You will both pay for this. Yet in the end, only you were the one who paid. Though how do you mean he sold out his tribe? I'm going to need an elaboration on that. Must not give up. Is it done, Zindar? Is Arzeth dead? It is true, Zindar. I was once Neladu, the Keeper of Earth. It was I who betrayed the other Dreykhut elders in exchange for empty promises of power. That's because you're stupid. You can despise me now if you wish to. What matters is that my tribe is free once again and that the spirits have returned to us. I will not be joining the rest of my tribe, but I can die in peace now. We can do commit suicide. May the spirit of Earth find a new servant among my brothers. Go on, then. He doesn't look like he's committing suicide anytime soon. So. Okay, then. Oh my gosh. I. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I did not know anyone came up here. I was otherwise occupied. Holy shit. Please die. This is not part of the plan. Oh my. Whew. That was not expected at all. Oh, so now he's over there. So we still need to go west and grab these uh, Thornfang dudes. And then there was one more. Ah, oh, the Colossi. That's right, uh, up by there. So I guess we'll go get the Thorn Fangs. No, I don't think I'm going to get this, this plant. It's a little too close in proximity. Oh boy, very close in proximity <laughs> to the others. Alrighty, you were included on my list of things to kill, so goodbye, Thorn Fang Venom Spitter. But you don't seem to be spitting venom. You seem to just be. Yeah, there you go. There it is. My casting is so slow. Please tell me that's something that gets fixed later on or, or something. I don't know. It just seems unbearable. Or I get faster abilities or something. I don't know. I can continue at this speed. It just takes so long. Dot you to hell and back. And you too. You can all die of dots. Over there. Let's see how long these roots hold. Okay, the answer is not for very long. <laughs> well, surviving the dot, so that's good news. Strategy. 
Are you your ravager? Should get my little ants out. Make life quicker. Nice work, little ants. And off they go. I can't believe it's a constant cast. You know? We need to get this to have a better dot. It really doesn't do much damage over time. At least this one isn't an, it's just a numbers game. It's not about what you get from them. It's positive. As long as your friend doesn't join the fight. Your friend did not join the fight today. Oh, he's about to. Oh, there we go. And are we getting another friend to the fight? Well, I just fetch them to the fight regardless. Still have to kill more of these dudes. Fantastic. I'm sorry for moving. Sheesh, ooh, we missed our first step. There we go. Ow. Ow. do as much damage as I'd like it to do. I feel very impotent. I don't feel like I hit as hard. I feel like it's a lot quicker for me to kill things as my hunter than it is for this character. Even though creatures scale to us. So it really is each character's individual abilities to fight. And I just... I find it's a very slow class to kill. I don't feel like I'm doing nearly enough damage. That was the wrong button for us in case you're wondering. It takes forever. What do I need to kill? A venom spitter. So I'm a smaller dude. You're a smaller dude, right? Venom spitter. So you just say it just. It doesn't do much damage at all. It's just... Why am I fighting like this when it, it doesn't really have much of an impact? This doesn't seem very practical. There's got to be a faster way of doing things, right? This can't be it. Okay, how big are these colossi and how hard are they to kill? Well, that doesn't look very promising for a, from a starting perspective. Good news is, can be rooted. It's a fantastic start. I'm gonna need some help. Oh, whoa, 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 what is this? No one said anything about an extra. Ah! Oh, I thought he was coming back towards me. No, he turned around, thank God. Crimson Crystal Clue. Okay, let's just get out of the direct line of fire. 
As the Colossus falls under the weight of your attacks, you notice for the first time that it was holding a red crystal fragment. While it was small and unnoticeable in the mountain giant's hand, it's a fairly hefty piece for you to carry around. It also suspiciously looks like a piece of the giant crystal in the middle of the ridge. It's most definitely a clue as to the strangest that is occurring here, and you're sure that the druids at the Scenarium Post to the south will want to see it. Okay. Cool. Just trying to get more than one battle, please. We're going to have to solo this for a bit because my ants are a little out. But that's okay, I suppose. Ow. Ow. This is not going so well. There's two of these dudes. Okay, I need to seriously not die. I was hoping the dot would do a lot more damage than it's doing. I keep saying that. Okay, expect that to change. Dream foil. To do absolutely nothing in my collection. Don't look at me like that! Doing the best I can under the circumstances, alright? You will take that stun, sir. Hello, sir. That's uh, caps lock. That is definitely not to tap. Oh no! Oh no! We're a massive cooldown here. Oh, this is this might be a very grim situation. Ability. I'm so not using it until I know what it does. Teleport what? Teleport Moonglade. What? Why would I want to do that? I have no idea what that means. Uh, one more. One more. I don't really know why I want to teleport anywhere. Oh dear. Alrighty, that is five, four, five, and that I believe is quest complete. Oh, Jesus Christ, let's get out of there. I'm so glad I noticed that in the nick of time. That would have been unpleasant, to say the least. I'm kind of curious about doing it regardless. <laughs> Anywho, let's turn on all these quests and then figure out what that new ability is. Hello? Would you like to zoom in? Dolothian. be with you. Good work. If you ask me, all that we have to do is kill enough of those colossi and then we won't have to worry any longer about the ridge of that strange crystal in the middle of it. Here, take one of these as a gift from the Scenarian Expedition. Light your power. That's a big crystal you have there. Did you get that while you were up on the ridge killing colossi? Let me take a look at it. Hmm, just looks like a big lump of unrefined crystal to me. Admittedly, I can feel a sickly evil aura emanating off of it. But that's not exactly in my line of work. I'm just here to put an end to the mountain giant menace. Well then, who, who do I have to go see? The Earthbinder. You should take the crystal lump over to the Earthbinder. Who is the Earthbinder? She's just like you, always needing to get to the bottom of a mystery and thinking all the time. If you ask me, she thinks a little too much. Just give it to her and I'm sure she'll get you into a heap of trouble figuring out what's going on up there on the ridge. 
Take the Crimson Crystal Shard to Earthbinder Galandria Nightbreeze at the Scenarian Post. Ah, Scenarian Post. No, wait, Scenarian Post is here. Who am I talking to? Galandria Nightbreeze. There is no Galandria Nightbreeze here. Isn't this the post? Refuge is over there. I don't know who I'm talking to. Okay, whatever. Hell. Demonic contamination. Were you able to collect the blood samples? Well done, Zindar. These blood samples will prove helpful in my research and in the expedition's wider studies of Outland's creatures. If I could isolate what causes these creatures to change continuously, perhaps I could concoct an antidote. Of course, she's going to give me more bloody quests. Testing the antidote. I think there's something we can use in the blood as a base of an antidote. Don't look at me like I've lost my mind. It's a common theme in nature. Often, the cure for something can be derived from the toxin itself. That's just what I aim to do. Ridding the boars of their demonic influence would probably eliminate their aggression and give us insight into how best attempt to help other species. Use the serine antidote on a hulking hellbore and observe the results. Once you have the results of the experiment, return to Thea Redmain at the Sonarian Red Post in... Sonarian Post, sorry, in Hellfire Peninsula. Goodbye. Okay. You... Oh, there you are! Oh man, you've probably had a quest for me and I've been ignoring Hail. you. My apologies. Keep them fighting in hill clear. With the ravages cleared, travellers to and from the Scenarian Refuge in Zangamar should have an easier time of it. A Scenarian expedition is indebted to you. May the eternal Yay, sun you don't give me an extra quest. Huzzah! What brings you here? Is that a piece from the giant crystal shard up on Fallen Sky Ridge? Oh, excellent. Oh, wow. She is doing a happy dance. Oh, yeah. I've been waiting to get my hands on a piece of that thing, but Tolathion's been dragging his feet. He's supposed to be out there helping me to investigate what's going up on up at, on up on okay <laughs> fallen sky Ridge. instead he's just been sending poor dupes like you no offense up there into the slaughter mill if you give me the crystal maybe i can find a link between it and the colossi Illumine. well that was quick oi what happened to that quest let's plant this shard in the ground and see what happens i mean sure but like where'd your quest go Okay, I'm just going to follow the creepy lady. Galandria. I don't really have a quest to do this, but sure. Is it going to sprout a crystal? It's. Is it just me or is that floating? Ah! Are you insane, lady? Put it down quick. Let me just get right on that, shall I? Please tell me we're not doing that again. Peace be with you. Natural remedies. It must be that the evil emanations from that giant crystal are summoning the insane giants and driving them insane. It's too big to move and beyond our ability to destroy, but I know a way to quell its power. I've summoned a circle at the northwest corner of the crystal on the ridge. Take the seed to the circle and channel its powers to heal the land through the natural forces of rain, growth, and insect repopulation. Beware, Zendar. Since an external force at play here, this is not natural. Use a seed of revitalization at the Earthbinder Circle to heal the land around the crystal. Then return to Earthbinder Galandria Nightbreeze at the scenario post and help evidence with any original game. May the stars die. What a mouthful. How many of these bastards do I have to? One? Great. Consider yourself healed. So you're going to hit me anyway. Okay, that's good to know. Thanks. Now this is a normal looking form. Okay, he turned into a normal boar. He was still really aggroed and I didn't appreciate that. But hey, at least he aggroed me in a natural state. Well met. Do you have the results of the experiment? Thea read Main's eyes widen as he described the result of the experiment. But how could that happen? I'm certain I prepared the antidote correctly. I've seen it work with spider and snake venoms, so why would it backfire here? Perhaps it's one of Outland's many peculiarities, Zindar. I'd best pass the information along to my comrades. May the yes, no request from you either. Great. Up the top we go. At a some more brisk pace, please. Where's the Fell Reaver? I can't see him. That's partially a good sign. Let's avoid all these colossi, though they appear to be conspicuously absent. Which is delightful. Oh god. 
Oh god. Okay, kitty form it is. There are so many of them. Holy shit. <gasps> I don't know how I'm going to get to where I need to go. Without dying. <laughs> How do I do this without being killed by four colossi at once? Oh god. Good news is they're not aggroing while I do this. Oh, I'm totally going through that colossus. Sorry, buddy. And just what do you think you were doing? You dare interfere with my master's experiment? Pafeli on the calculator. Okay. Now what? Do you like what we've got out here? Ha, ah, your ritual has failed. Awesome. Trying to read his text to really pay attention to what I was doing. So I've got to keep doing this. Will the same thing just happen again when he gets too close? Nope, he comes back. And then we do the exact same thing again. So I can't afford to be attacked, in other words. Do you like what we've done here? Perhaps we will drop these crystals from the sky all over Outland. I grow bored with your attempt to heal the land and quell the energy summoning and driving the Colossae mad. Golathi, Goliathan, King of the Colossi, Prince Kalthas, and I demand that you defend the crystal. Prince Kalthas. Is that you, sir? Great. I have a bit of that and a bit of that, and I still don't know what my big ability does, so we're just going to have to ignore that for now. Oh dear. Oh dear. Stop doing that. Oh fuck, do not shoot me into one of you fucks. God, that did not work. Well, at least I got that AOE. Holy shit! Um, I don't know if I can come out of this spot, can I? Um, can you please not attack me? I don't know how to get out of here. I do not want to die here. Do not let me die here. Sure. Every, more the merrier down here. Meanwhile, I'm still stuck. Um. Is this a ridge for the idiots who get stuck down here? I can't get up this. Um, is this supposed to happen? Now's a chance to figure out what this does. Casting Teleport Moonglade will, while in Moonglade, will tell, return you back to your departure, to near your departure point. What do you mean to near your, what does this, <laughs> what? What does this do? Hey, I've got Moonkin form. How long have I bloody had that for? Why are you not on my bar? What? What does this do? Well, I'm stuck here. I physically cannot get out. So whatever this is, sure. Go right for it. I can't get out. Now the question is, where the hell am I? 
Moonglade Night Haven. Well, this is a lovely place. Where am I? I'm in Kalimdor. Well, this seems like a nice peaceful place. Have I never seen this place before? It's literally right back next to my starting point. As, as Kalira. Wow. Okay, put me back. It did say near. Near your departure point. So I'm hoping it takes me out of that bloody rift. But I'm curious just to know why it would take me here. What is here? Fuck. Fuckity, fuckity, fuck. How... How do I get out? Oh god, I got stuck for a bit there. She's a bit of a hefty lady. Oh, can I get out of this? Or is this too steep as well? Can you please move first? I don't want to deal with you while I'm trying to get out of this groove. God, you're slow. Uh, jump! Jump! You can do it! Come on, come on. And the answer is no, you can't do it. What about over this way? Yes, I'm free! Almost. Fuck this. Oh my god, why would you have a gap? Why would you physically even want to have a gap between that shit? Wait, I completed the quest, but I haven't even done the quest. I didn't- I didn't kill Galarian. Or whatever the fuck his name was. Goliathan. What? Okay, apparently I didn't need to kill him. I just needed to fight him. To learn who was the source of the corruption. Ah. Well, what do you know? I certainly didn't know that. 